Today I'll be showing you part two of my Lego Good Guy Army. So um here all of here is all of my minifigs. If you haven't seen part one, go check it out on my channel. It's available already. So if you don't know which minifigures I haven't shown yet, um I mean uh, which minifigures I have shown, I have shown this minifigure, these, these four. And then all the way to here. So we have got this, all of these minifigs to show you. So let's start off with the next minifig. So we have um, a new minifig. Some of these minifigs are new, so you haven't seen them. So yeah. Here we have a minifig that has a lime light to lime green uh katana he has got quite a he has got um a bit of a light beige i don't know how how what color that is but a type of brown hair he has got a happy face and he's got a bit of a i'm scared face see ah! so um, he has got um, the trousers he's got has got um, knee uh, knee pockets. Um, so yeah. Um, so at the back of his um, hoodie, he's uh, at the back of his torso. He's got a hoodie like the previous minifigure, the last minifigure of part one. So here he is. At the front, he's got a bit of a how do I say this? His shirt is kind of open. The top button is kind of open, as you can see. So, we're moving on to the next minifig. Minifigure. Here he is. He's the warrior. Um, I have gave him an an old knight helmet. I have. This is not really old. This is actually brand new. But the actual piece, um was made quite a long time ago <laughs> basically more than 20 years ago this has been seen so yes if you if you're being if you've been collecting lego for quite a long time and you have the old 1900 lego night sets you might have seen this piece before he's got Quite a cool printing of a shirt. His actual torso is from my McLaren Senna set. You might have known from um, the mark on his front. And it says McLaren Senna at the back. So here's a McLaren Senna sign. I mean the McLaren sign. And at the back, if if I turn it around, um, you can see McLaren Senna. You can see the word McLaren Senna, and I don't know what that says because I haven't really seen that before. I just realized it right now. So, um, yeah, next minifigure. We have the next minifigure. We have the Master of um, Earth. Here is Cole. Um, I have gave him um, a bit of the actual Aquino's shirt from season 12 because he has like a bit of a regular Lego City shirt it doesn't really look too cool on a ninja so I gave um Aquino's shirt because Aquino's shirt is more like a ninja so yeah and I gave him this type of weapon because in his actual digi digi form he's got um a uh he's got this actual weapon except he's got that gaming thing gaming um hilt and then he's got a small um bit of a stick at the at the end so yeah here he is um so he has um got quite cool hair as well his hair is a bit messy it's like he's just woke up um that's really how he is um um, so he's got two faces, a bit of an angry face 
and if I turn him around, I'm of a keen face. And his actual torso at the front is a bit like a Dojo Masters torso. And yeah, um, it doesn't the leg printing doesn't really have much printing, so the legs aren't really that um um cool. So yeah, and suddenly it and you can see him better now. Okay, next mini thing. Here we have Spider Man. So I don't really have to tell a spin around Spider Man because. Spider-Man is very popular, so yeah, you might know him, so I'll just spill and spin him one time, so if you do not really know him, you can find out who he is. Because Spider-Man is very a popular um, superhero, so yeah. I gave him this red katana that matches his red form, so yeah. I'll, here he is. So now let's spin him. A bit quicker. Next minifigure. I've got Ryan Hart from the um, Overwatch um, theme of Lego. I know Overwatch, the actual Overwatch game is for, for 16 and up. But I don't even play that game. Uh, my friend does, but I don't. I just like, I only have one set of Overwatch. I only like the Overwatch um, set that I've got only for the robot ball joints and for the minifigures because the helmet looks pretty cool and the actual mech looks awesome with that hammer piece with that hammer and that new piece on the front of the hammer and a bit of like a flame so yeah and um, he's got two faces and um, he's got a He's actually got this face. I need to take a hair off one of my minifigs because it's actually from Ryan Hart's um, minifigure's hair. Because before I put this hair on one of my minifigures, um, that minifigure did not exist until I got this set. So let me take it off. As you can see, this is his face of when his uh, helmet is on. And here is his face when he's got his hair on it looks quite creepy without one eye he's only got one eye so it's kind of creepy <laughs> i thought he was like um chira inwe from star wars when he's actually got special power instead of um no eyes i'm not sure if he does have eyes because i'm not really so let me just put his helmet back on So here, I've gave him this huge iron fist, so he can look a bit powerful, and um, I gave him those fi that fist, so he can look a bit like a rhino, because rhinos are pretty strong. Um, so yeah, um, moving on to the next figure. Oh yes, yeah, Speedy, as you might know, the guy with the hat. Um, he, he is very fast, as in, like, in a blink of an eye, he, he's like, how would I say this? He's in uh, Mount Everest, and then in a blink of an eye, he's in, I don't know, the park or something. <laughs> or even, like, a restaurant eating pizza, and he's finished it. He is very quick. He goes like... <laughs> Uh, but even quicker, um, he's actually way faster than me. Um, he's got this cool laser blaster. Um, this uh, this limeish green, this yellowy green, um, is from my new Lego Ninjago set, as well as this um, white um, bit of a like sniper piece. Um, so yeah, if you're really interested in Lego Ninjago, I've got. Uh, two Lego Ninjago sets. If you want the easier way to watch it, just go on my playlist. I've got a whole playlist of Ninja Lego Ninjago and 
something that's not really Ninjago, but it's based on Ninja. So I have got quite a lot of nin Ninja. Um, so I will um, add more stuff to my playlist. So I I will uh, after this video I will add my new Lego Ninjago. Uh, my all all my videos that are not in my playlist I will put in my playlist. And if I wanted to, I'd make a playlist where you where all my videos are in so you can just quick uh, easily watch all my videos in just a click so i might do that so now we're going on to the next figure here we have got a new figure he's um he's quite cool he's got a bit of like um orange legs and um, he's got the lime green katanas he's got iron he's got on um, quite a smiley face um as well he has got an extreme mark on his um torso so yeah that's all i can say for him and as well he's got a a arm that doesn't really have like on this arm he's got nothing on this arm but he's got um actual shirt arm on this arm so yeah um let's move on to the next figure so here we have the actual minifigs if you're um quite interested to see them again here we have the minifigs um so the minifigure that i'm going to choose next is here so to keep in track we're all the way over here so if you want to see this squad over here very special squad i will tell you their squad name um later on in the video so this is a minifigure that I'm going to choose next. Here we have another new figure. He's got this um, Lego Ninjago um, clear piece. It's in my new Lego Ninjago um, set. He's got a scarf on him. He's got two um, grass, um, grassy arms. As you can see, it's basically this colour. So I don't really expect you to look at his arm. You can just look at the base plate that's his colors arm and he's got this golden hilt and he's got um quite a cool face so yeah i don't know what these lines are on his face over on his cheek i don't know what they're supposed to represent as you can see over here there's a bit of a line two lines actually um so yeah we're moving on to the next figure here we have the next figure um so here um this was the minifigure that i was talking about um that had this hair if if this hair did not exist this minifigure never existed either he's got the silver katana as well um i have after i got that lego ninjago set um he had a very I had a very low amount of katanas and um, after I've got that Lego Ninjago set I've got a lot of katanas <laughs> um so yeah he has got quite an angry face as well he's got a, a face he's got another face that I never show because of his one of his eye is gone as you can see uh, over the years as over the three years I had this minifigure head yeah you might have seen the printing has gone so that's why i'm doing it on his angry face because that's the only face that actually looks perfect so yeah um he's got great arms and a volcano bit he's got a vo volcano bit on his back as you can see because this is actually um the old 2016 um volcano explorer sets i got this for my birthday um like in 2017 <laughs> that's quite a long time ago so you might be wondering yeah um and that head i got like four like here we have the next figure um you might be wondering um this head looks weird well yes it's not actual lego so um it's um never mind um so here's got the exactly the same um hair i mean shirt as the minifigure that i said 
like three minifigs ago. <laughs> three minifigs ago. So I don't really need to say anything about his torso. His legs are very simple. The only the only thing that's special is his gun. He's got um, my own custom weapon. Um, it's quite cool when you look at it. It's got two modes. A very um, powerful mode that goes like non-stop. That goes like... And a mode that goes like actual powerful um, piece. So, um, yeah, the powerful um, mode actually shoots one bullet, but one powerful big bullet so it's got two modes i'd prefer the mode that shoots quite a lot of bullets so yeah um moving on to the next figure as well on his face you might have noticed quite i don't know what that is but i don't remember its names it's a microphone i just remembered um there's a microphone on his uh head it's supposed to, there is a helmet that came with him so that helmet, I don't know where it is in my, it's in my a very big pile of Lego, so I don't really have time to, like, find it. So, yeah, moving on to the next figure. So, we have Lightning squ Squad. I just remembered that I said Steve before, so we're moving on to Lightning Squad's, um, Ultra um guy with the wet the two katanas actually lightning squad is not a real theme in lego i just made this up like in stars there's a squad called delta squad i got the idea from delta squad to make my own lightning squad there are two people in um lightning squad but in delta squad in stars there's four so quite um a low increase of minifigs but since there's only two um because they're quite strong in another fact so yeah if you want to see what's under that helmet nothing too special just a regular blank white head that's why i just use these cool helmets and these cool visors um to make them look very cool i have just took off um richie's lego ninjago armor off and his katanas as i said when i showed in part one red visor um so yeah not much really to talk about he has got quite cool armor he's got a bit of like splashed paint on his legs at the front and he's got a bit of like a hashtag on his visor as you can see he's got a hashtag on his visor over here see he's got a hashtag on his visor both of them have got a hashtag on their visor I just, just saw that uh, when I spin it around to myself. Um, moving on to the next person in Lightning Squad. Here we have another Lightning Squad character. He is the one with the huge um, machine gun blasters, as I said before. These, um, I, he's got the actual Iron Man torso. I just I don't know why I keep... Um, um, Taking off my minifigure parts and then switching and make my own custom minifigs. It's just so cool. I don't know how. It's just so cool. Um, so yeah, he's got um, two different color blasters as um, we saw before. He's got this Lego Ninjago Season 13 armor. And like I said, um, he's got this time, he's got another type of blue. He's got the exact same thing. Hashtag as well. Um, under his helmet, like I said, nothing too special. Just the white head. I don't want to use my minifigs heads that actually have printing when they have helmets on. So I don't really um, lose too many minifigs. Um, so that means if I just use these regular white heads, I've got two more minifigs that I can make. So that's the good thing. The bad thing if I put a actual minifigure head is that I lose two new minifigs. So that's why I just use the regular white heads. So now we're moving on to the last two figs of my army. I'll show them both together. Here we have the last two minifigs. These are actually the explorers of the team. They've got two mining 
my uh, I don't know pickaxes. Um, these pickaxes as well came in my new Lego Ninjago set. I don't know how all the good pieces came in my new set. Thanks, Lego Ninjago season twelve, and thanks to Lego to making this Lego Ninjago theme and season twelve. And you and they've got a chainsaw as well. And one of them has a helmet um, for protection. The other one has um, a visor. So that's all I can say for now. I hope you guys like it. Subscribe to see my videos. Bye, guys. Just put them back. Take this off. My full arm.